Virtual reality and mixed reality are changing the industry in a big way. It's everywhere from uh, flight simulators, it's being used in, in all parts of the industry right now. It's bringing a level of training that we haven't been able to fully see before with the traditional device. Traditional training devices are expensive. They're also very, very large. Visual displays are oftentimes as large as we can make them, but they have blind spots. They have parts that you can't see from uh, the cockpit that, that you would need to sometimes in the real aircraft. But with our Veris virtual reality flight simulator, it's very small and, and it's much more inexpensive. And that's through the combination of this new technology. So as we are able to get more of these devices fielded in the world and and not force pilots to travel halfway around the world to do their training, but be able to bring that training close to home to them. Uh, we think that aviation safety will improve and the whole industry will improve for it. We have been actively working with both EOS and the FAA uh, on our new device and getting this qualified. For civilian pilots, it's, it's really important because they have to get a certain amount of training hours per year in, in a simulator or in, in some sort of a device. They need to be able to perform their checks every year, and, and these things can only be done if they are accepted by the regulatory body. We have integrated the Vario XR4 into our simulator. We think it's the best out there because of what it can do. I mean, it, it has a wide field of view, it has high resolution, and it enables us to, to do what we need to do and to, to really achieve what the regulators are looking for, which is meeting the quality, meeting the clarity, and meeting all the things that we need to to achieve that scene that's expected.